Hello everyone. Today we will see how to remove a DVD disc which is get stuck inside a DVD player. When you switch on, there will be noise. This noise shows that you can clear it clarifies that the drive belt that is tray tray drive belt is damaged or is cut so we will remove the DVD and fix the problem unplug the drive from the mains okay let's add the screws side widen the back panel separate it like this hold here pull it aside push it back okay. now here you can see the disc To remove the disc, we need to unscrew these two screws here. Pull this cover here. Okay. Remove this magnet. Okay. This is the disc which was stuck. Remove it out. Now, for this one, slide this drive lock here. Show you. Here, slide this one here just a bit. Okay. Yes. The lens pickup goes down, push this tray outside, slowly, yes, here you can see the lock, one opening here, right, here, there is a lock inside, push it the left little bit left push the tray back side outside push it left and push the tray out okay yes now the tray comes out these are the two locks which we pushed out this one lock and here one more lock these two we should separate aside then we can open the tray easily this is the belt you can see the belt here it is cut we will replace it as I have to purchase it from market so if you have an emergency of the DVD player instead of the belt you can use one rubber band which is of the same size of the belt here you can see same size or little bit reduced size but this will work only for few runs only for a week you can say see just hope it's clear just push it out yes 
here you can see okay after that slightly clean this clean the tray not on the lens clean it separately with a brush see that the dust won't fall on the lens pick up insert the tray lightly like this push it yes okay actually for the tray here there will be one more panel I don't know the customer has the person using this DVD player has damaged it or removed it I don't know that this came to me as it is okay now you can plug in and see whether the motor works okay switch it on okay see now I'll open it yes the tray is working now yes here you see tray open close it's working perfectly after this you just Fix the top magnet holder, drive disc holder. Okay, if you can say in this way, this is the right way. Fasten the screws. Okay, it's now while purchasing the belt from market, see that it is of the same size. If it is bigger than this, sometimes the tray will not come out. If it is smaller than this, the belt will get cut within a few days. Please be keep that in mind and buy the belt. The belt doesn't cost much, so you can buy the same size. Okay guys. We will fix the top panel now. Once we will see, turn the DVD and check. You can see. It's running here. Oh. You can see the clock, right? Timing moving on. It's in play mode. Okay, we'll fix the top panel now. We'll cover it up. Stop it. Unplug the DVD dryer. Power it off. it fix the top Fasten the screws. DVD player has an USB port also. See that if your USB is not reading, 
either this port will be damaged or there will be no 5 volts coming to this port reverse check reverse trace it from where the 5 volts should come there you can check it and replace the components accordingly okay guys see you in next videos bye